Hi, Bill Mobley looking at uh, our program for Tuesday, the 9th of October, for the, the last day, if you will, of the ANA meeting to be held in Boston from the 7th through the 9th of October. Just looking at the program and uh, uh, would uh, like you to pay attention to two very nice symposia. Again, the symposia follow career development sessions in the morning and uh, are followed in the evening by special interest group sessions. Uh, the Derek Denny Brown Symposium will be held on Tuesday morning. I have the honor to share that session. Uh, we will be uh, honoring uh, two Denny Brown scholars. Uh, the first is Don Kleindorfer from the University of Cincinnati, who will talk about temporal trends and acute stroke management. The second is Brian Trainer from the NIH, who will talk about a large repeat expansion in C90, C9 ORF72 as a common cause of ALS and FTD. And following that, we've got the following speakers. Sean Pittock, these are new members of the ANA. Sean Pittock, Patrick Chinnery, Mustafa Sahin, Sidney Cash, who will give the Grouse, Grass Foundation lecture, uh, Dugyu Selson, and Martin Titular. So join us in the morning for talks from these uh, bright young people who are new members of our organization. Uh, I would love for you to be there to uh, listen carefully, but to also provide your moral support to these folks who are just beginning their careers as research neurologists, academic neurologists. The afternoon, uh, the last major symposium of the meeting, very exciting advances in headache and pain research and treatment, chaired by Bob Messing and Clifford Wolf. Uh, we'll talk about the pathophysiology of migraine, about neuropathic pain genes, about nociceptor signaling, and we'll have an update on recent trials using antibodies to NGF to uh, ameliorate chronic pain. Our, our speakers are Remy Burstein, Clifford Wolf, uh, Bob Messing, Roy Freeman, and David Kornblatt. I think it's going to be an exciting session. I'm going to learn a lot. I'm sure you will too. And I hope to see you there.